Yeah, uh, yeah so my name is Tony Riff. I'm an illustrator, uh, freehand drawing, digital artwork, graffiti, all of the above, so, you know, all kind of stuff. So I think today, you know, I'm just going to approach it the same way I do it, like in a page of my sketchbook where I kind of just make it up as I go along, add little things here and there and just keep it organic really, you know, yeah. I just wanted to do something where every time you look at it, you might notice like a little thing that I didn't see before and yeah, just uh, keep it real playful. My main challenge is like trying not to smudge the entire thing because I always have a habit of leaning on everything when I'm drawing. So that's the main challenge. Apart from that, obviously just figuring out what goes where. But, you know, again, there's no rules to it, really. Yeah, it's really, it's a lot more intense than I thought. You know, I think usually I've had experience using UV ink and, and usually sometimes it can be a bit washy. But yeah, this one is just like, it just really pops out. So. Yeah. So that's the tough part. So I'm figuring out whether to actually draw over the speaker bit or kind of leave that blank because there's so much going on. So I'm trying to figure out whether to keep it, keep that nice contrast in terms of having that busy part of it and then just having like a simple kind of like sparse bit just to let it breathe a bit. I started off a bit shaky, but near the end, I started to like it a lot more. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. Honestly, it's just, you know, when it comes to like these kind of freestyle drawings, it's so, it's almost more about shapes and just how things are interacting rather than anything in particular, you know, it's almost like, a, it's abstract, but it's not at the same time, you know, if you look in there, then you'll see some characters and other objects, but there's still some random shapes and things like that as well. So it's, it's yeah, it's a mishmash of different things. Yeah, yeah I think that's the, the hardest part of it was just, actually knowing what I was going to do <laughs> and how to finish it.